Hello, I'm Ines and I'm an Application Engineering Team Leader at Materialize. In this video, I will show you how to quickly segment airways in Mimix. In this video, we're going to show you how to automatically segment an airway using the Segment Airway tool. This tool is located in the Advanced Segment menu. Before you start, choose the level of leakage detection. Leakages occur in regions where the contrast between the airway and the airway wall decreases. This causes the segmentation to leak into the pulmonary parenchyma and then lung tissue gets wrongly identified as an airway. This slider helps to control this behavior. Essentially, the weaker we set this, the more branches the segmentation will find, but it will also result in more leakages that you'll have to manually delete. With a stronger leakage detection, the branches won't go that deep, but we're a lot less likely to get those leakages. So for now, we recommend selecting a value somewhere in the middle. If you get a lot of leakages, you can always redo it with a stronger detection. Or if the segmentation doesn't detect as many branches as you'd like, try it again with a weaker detection. Once you have that set, hit Start and indicate the start of your trachea or where you want the segmentation to start. Then, place a second point to indicate the direction. We're going to choose a second point below that first point. This will automatically begin the segmentation process. While it's processing, we're going to rotate the model around to see if any leakages occur. If they do, remember the spots for later. It looks like there are two leakages in the left branch. Once it is done calculating, we'll see how to manually fix this. What you can do to fix the leakages is to left-click on the area. Then, right-click and put a leakage marker there. That is going to block it off and resegment that area. Another thing you can do is delete any individual segment. Also, if you want to delete farther up and include everything below that point, you can choose the option Delete with Children. The editing options are visible when you left-click on any segment and then right-click. If needed, you can also subdivide a branch into parts and then only delete a part of that division. Once you're finished editing the segmentation, you can go ahead and calculate a 3D object. Like any other 3D object, you can now edit this. You can hollow it out, export it in STL format, or fit a centerline to the airway and do the centerline measurements. 